There have been clashes with police in Belarus as thousands of protesters took to the streets of the capital Minsk for the eighth consecutive Sunday. Water cannons were used and some demonstrators were detained. Protesters responded by attacking one of the cannons. Many people in the country are disputing the result of the election two months ago, in which President Alexander Lukashenko was re-elected. Rallies in the capital have drawn as many as 200,000 people, with no sign of a let-up in the protests. Organisers of Sunday's demonstration dedicated the march to the plight of political prisoners. Over 7,000 people have been detained since the protests started. Police confirmed that they moved in to disperse participants because the event was considered an illegal gathering. Coverage of the march by news organisations was hampered as the authorities withdrew the accreditation of all foreign journalists in Belarus ahead of the event. On Friday, EU leaders agreed to impose sanctions on dozens of Belarusian officials over the alleged rigging of the presidential election. London and Washington have also rejected the result of the poll in which Lukashenko took 80% of the vote.